Hi, I'm Dr. Jeff Hall, international speaker and myth-busting orthodontist. In this video, we're going to discuss the typical issues that we need to look for to decide if that child needs early orthodontic intervention. The typical issues that you need to look for in a child to assess whether they need early orthodontic intervention are, do they have a functional problem? And there are many different functional problems that we see. For example, they could have an anterior crossbite where they have a functional shift. They could be a severe class three, but most commonly we see severe class twos where the mandible is too far back and we need to utilize growth at an early age to stimulate that mandible and hence resolve the problem. Those cases, if left untreated, may in fact require orthognathic surgery later. The other area that we need to look for is, is there an aberration of dental development? Are the teeth all coming down properly? For example, you might have an impacted canine or what we call an ectopically positioned canine or you might have an impacted central incisor. But we need to make sure that what we're gonna do is gonna restore dental development to a normal situation. So we want the teeth to be able to come down as if there was no problem. And the third area, which we see a lot of in our practice, is children with severe crowding. They might have five, eight, 10 millimeters of crowding. If left untreated in this early stage of development, they will require dental extractions later. But fortunately, with a lot of things that we can do at an early stage, by holding what we call the E-space, by distalizing the upper arch, we can gain all of this valuable space and avoid dental extractions for a lot of these patients. So in summary, early treatment should be designed to significantly reduce the severity of a malocclusion with the possibility of even eliminating it. If you want to learn more about early orthodontic therapy or orthodontics in general, visit orthoed.com.au, the most in-depth and trusted orthodontic course in Australia.